All right, so nice talking to you again. I know you were here in Amarillo for quite a while, uh, a few months back working on this story. So first off, just tell me a little bit more about your experience uh, shooting the story here in Amarillo. Well, it was fantastic. Amarillo was so good to us. They made sure we had everything we needed. And, you know, the people are so amazing, which is why it was so shocking to see the allegations that were coming about Dr. Mike Dixon and Dave Shepard. I mean, it just, and even officers there told us, you know, in such a nice place with good people, you don't see this kind of crime. You're talking about a pretty bizarre love triangle with really two unwitting participants, Rochelle Shatina and Dr. Joseph Sonye, because the allegation is Dr. Mike Dixon had Dr. Sonye killed because of his obsession over Rochelle Shatina. So, and you never see a case with two doctors doing these kinds of things. So this really was an odd experience, but I gotta tell you, the folks in Amarillo were very good to us. That's awesome, that's awesome to hear. So what's one thing that really stood out to you in covering this story? Rochelle Shatina and everything about her story. She's speaking for the first time tonight on ABC's 2020, and she is telling us everything she knows about this case. She has been maligned in so many ways out there as somebody who was dating different doctors and maybe was letting people like Dr. Mike Dixon down uh, in, in a really tough way. But her story is very different once you start talking to her. According to her, she was dating Dr. Dixon, didn't work out, moved on to Dr. Sonye, and started a relationship with him. And unbeknownst to her, Dr. Dixon is obsessing and trying to follow Dr. Sonia and trying to embarrass him and it escalates into murder. So for her, she feels like someone who one day wakes up, loses the new man that she's in love with, and a couple days later, she finds out it's at the hands of someone she used to be involved with. So for her, it was really tough to see how the media portrayed her and she really wants to clear the air and get her side of the story out there. That's awesome. So um, just kind of give us a little preview of what exactly we can expect to see tonight on 2020. Well, tonight, especially if you're in Amarillo, you know a lot about this case. Dr. Mike Dixon convicted of killing, at least hiring a hitman, Dave Shepard, to kill Dr. Joseph Sonye. They're both in prison right now. But what you're going to see tonight are a series of exclusive and in-depth interviews with the people in this trial. First, Rochelle Shatina will tell us her story, everything she went to, talking about what she told police and her warning out there for people dating and what they should know about the people they date and how sometimes they don't know what they think they know. We're also talking to the killer's daughters. Dave Shepard's daughters come forward for the first time to speak to us about what they went through, what it was like in that courtroom to see their daughter at one point, to see their dad at one point confess and later in court deny all that to save his friend. We're also talking to Dr. Dixon's son and we're talking to the victim's sons, the Sonye family boys. They talk about what it's like to not only lose their father, but two years earlier, their mother was murdered by her new husband. They lost two parents within the space of three years, both by murder. And they talk about how hard it was for them. So tonight you're going to see a very different 2020. It's not just a murder case. This is a case about how murder affects families and children and what the aftermath is like in the wake of death. Okay. Well, I guess that's all the time we have. So thank you so much for, you know, getting to talk to us. And we look forward to seeing it on air tonight. Sure thing. Take care. Thanks for having us. All right. Us. Thank you.